being an immigrant um, and being an entrepreneur and uh, being someone who's had a different journey than uh, someone who's been um, here across generations and they have had a little bit of a, a, a history where they're supported uh, in a different way um, in a country. I think what a lot of people don't realize is that um, when you are moving into a country, you are trying to fit in. You're trying to be yourself, but make sure that you're following certain norms and that you're accepted. And what has happened in the past is a lot of the corporate culture has um, been that their um, their groups and their people, and especially like in, I would say for like the advertising and design marketing community as well, there's, there's um, already existing communities. And when you're trying to come in and you want to make sure that you're accepted, it is a little bit of like, it's extra effort and extra work. Um, I think uh, in the past, there has been a lot of fitting in to the point where a lot of um, women had to fit in, fill, fit into the, the masculinity uh, structure or the stereotype in order to be promoted or to be a leader, to be a successful entrepreneur, or um, you would have to be um, sort of uh, watching uh, basketball or like certain games that you have to be watching in order to have fit into the conversation. So it was really um, whitewashed in a way. Um, I think now that the whole shift is happening where it's more inclusive and there's more um, inclusion for different cultural uh, sensitivities and curiosity there. So I hope that that change happens with the entrepreneurial la landscape as well.